Towns bits and booty bobs and I will do that and I'm gonna do future once I've done this whole footage thing I might do a few challenges that I've been cooking up in my own head uh, one of them is to beat the game in only level in level one only and the second one is to beat the game with only the king and key which is actually quite a challenge And if I'm filling up for it, I will try both. But I cannot promise that one. And yeah, my birds are awake today. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so this is completely different from what I've been doing. So what I remember is that do is that If I remember right, the old mansion's out past the woods. I'm seriously craving ice cream. Right, I'm just gonna do all of this real quick. Yeah. I'm gonna go and do this. Oh, Sarah, go! Oh, Sarah, go! Yeah. Oh, Sarah, go. Yeah. Is there some kind of blotch up there on the screen? Nice! Well, I'll help you find yeah. the next one. Yeah, you I'd know do. those ears anywhere. I'm gonna go for the chest as well. Hmm. Let's see. Should be one over here. Huh. And I yeah. don't know if I'm just gonna. Oh, huh. you're right. Um, so I'm so I'm not going to go that way. Hey, Mark, yeah. I'm just going to get through. Whoa! Yes! 
She went as far last night to uh sh to download the entire mm -hmm. What's that? Oh. Heartless. Heartless. What do you think they're up to? Uh -huh. Hmm. Look! On that branch! The Heartless have him surrounded! Oh no! What's that? Yeah! What's that? What's that? Well, take care. you to pick up the fruit for him. Mm, okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit? Right then. So, what are you gonna do with all this anyway? Okay. 
You be careful going home. See you around. So adorable. Next stop, the mansion. Yeah. You guys may quit making noise. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think I might put it back down. That little feller sure seems happy. I get Let's see. That building up ahead. Yeah. 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 Let's see. Nice picture, Sora. All of them. Hey. That one. Oh, I know that one is. Yeah. It's a shame we couldn't go inside the mansion. Like, I would have loved to go inside the mansion. What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, they do say that this mansion is haunted. Did I scare you? Ana, wait, uh, oh. the thing is, <laughs> what? What? I'm confused. How oh, hard bad. So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope, afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep, this old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. You know what I would have loved? I would have loved a um like at least see like the rest of Twilight Town. Going on about now. Here we go. Eh, the password was uh sea salt ice cream, right? Hey. Okay, I'm in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh, oh man, the transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. Well, huh? Hello, 
Sora. You wouldn't yeah, happen no. to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah, but how do you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know any slug. Oh, oh, and what? You do? <laughs> I know. Oh, I haven't got a clue. <laughs> then, uh... Oh, for the love of God. Who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so... I can't uh... run it. Which program? The uh... transporter to the other Twilight Town! Uh... It's the only way to find Roxas! You gotta help us! Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm not even gonna bother finding Okay, sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh... Basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly. And we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. I can't computer, so do that. Glad you're following along. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chippendale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. He was recompleted like the rest of us. Lazy but hadn't yes. regained consciousness yet. Then... Sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah! See ya, Hainer. Hey, you're gonna need a Bye, Donald. Than four. Goofy. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pants. <laughs> hey. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Who actually? Like, oh, that's a question that I want to know now. Does anyone actually like 358 slash two days? Or am I like the only person that likes it? Because I've been playing it a little bit lately. And I will record, hopefully I will record a Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2. Alright. 
So, what's next? <laughs> oh, I swore. Punishments needed. So, you think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. Oh, Handsome! Oh. Samness! Okay, I wanna... Roxas should gonna never have me. existed so in I the first place. Up, what you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely the event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just oh gonna God, put him back there. Roxas now? Do you even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just Data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside Data. There are hearts all around us. Hmm. Oh. Handsome and Zemnis used to be part of the same person, right? But look, now they exist separately just fine. Mm. If they can do it, then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you tell them Captain Goofy. Oh my god, Roxas. In that case, by all means. Nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. You wish? He'll never answer to you again! Still so blind, a nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness, there is only one way to bring Roxas back, which is for you to give your heart up as well. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> what? Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <sighs> now, set your heart free. Wait! Uh, it's not darkness. Not if it helps him. Herc said... He said, with all my heart. 
Okay. Then all my heart it is. I'm getting Roxas out. Are you with me? Donald? Goofy? <laughs> you bet you! I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. Okay then, let's head back to town. Hmm. Hey. Out of the small blue. Who rescued my chef? I can't do straws. Huh? Wait, didn't he sell ice cream in Hollow Bastion? That's right. But Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. <laughs> how are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making a menace of himself. Uh, why did you have to say that? So, Uncle Scrooge, what's that you were saying about a chef? Oh, right, right. The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for you. Hmm, what is it? Wow! Cake! Huh? The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I mean, uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce Little Chef? Oh! oh. It's... Hi! It all started a little while ago when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So I thought, that's an opportunity. And I financed the whole operation. Ooh! I think he wants to cook some more for you. Fetch some ingredients. Especially anything unusual. That'll be fun. Kinda like a scavenger hunt. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. You can start right here in town. We'll do anything to try more of Little Chef's food. Yeah. That tart sure did look scrumptiously delicious. Okay, the ingredient right. hunt is on. You did the thing, Ego. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Little yeah. chef yeah. needs more ingredients. We better keep an eye out. Nice moves! Oh, yo! Uh, 
Stop little chef will whip up with ha. beer. Ha. Hope we find some ingredients around here. Now I know that it will give me money. Hey, boss. Uh, Done with the posters. Uh -huh. Hey! Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the Bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, Sora. Hold your phone up to the poster. There, you've just downloaded a promo game for the film. You can try it later. Yeah, Dad. Of course, laddie. Provide a bit. It's a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry and eager to spend their money. Uncle <laughs> <laughs> Scrooge. Gore, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. Oh yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I need to warn you guys. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of him for us? You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. It's our job! But we'll definitely be back. When are you gonna slow down? Sorry. Just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost. But Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. Mm. That was funny. So, I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. I, 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 I what? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. 
Oh, I'm wishing. Was it yeah. Was it Me and else? Pence too. On a few years later? Yeah. Last year? Thanks. Seriously, who was Lee Roxas' love interest? And it's still messing with my brain. And then I realized it might not be nominee. Well, nominee, I don't know why I would think nominee. Hey, it's usually Bar. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes, just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Huh. Fair enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. But in that case, we'll have to find ourselves another vessel. That is why we never have just one iron in the fire. Hey. Here it is. Let's see. Got it. Just a ma- Get in the yummy stuff, little chef will whip up with this. I'm sorry I left without saying goodbye. Did Master Yen Sid tell you? I'm training to become a Keyblade wielder like you. That's right. 
No more waiting for you to come back from your adventures. I want to get out there and do my part to help. Merlin has used his magic to bring us to a place where time doesn't matter. We can take as long as we need to complete our training. He's an amazing wizard. Oh, and by us, I mean me and Lee. He's really sorry for all the trouble he caused. I told him it's fine, oh, but no, he won't no, stop no. apologizing. I'll admit I was a little scared of him at first, but I've gotten to know him better. All he ever wanted was to help his friend. Honestly, it's hard not to like him. Every now and then, I catch him staring at me. When I ask what's wrong, he says, I'm not sure. I think I'm forgetting something. Don't know what. Sora, I think it may have something to do with you. Your journey is all about helping people. Some that you've never met before. And some like Lee that you have. They're all counting on you. It won't be easy. But I hope you'll remain the happy and cheerful Sora I know. There's no heart your smile can't reach. What's wrong? Huh? Uh, nothing. Sorry. Lee. What? I am. <laughs> I can't take them seriously with a, like, dark head now. A letter? Yep. To Sora? Mm, technically, yes. But I won't send it. It's more for me. Ask Merlin. He'll deliver it for you. Yeah. But it's okay. I just like talking Honestly, to Sora, at this point, even if like, it's on no, paper. No, 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 no. Oh, Please, okay. Axel, whatever you are. Hey, oh. Hmm? Here. Ice cream? Really? Yeah, no, I asked Merlin that. to pick these up. You know, we did both summon Keyblades. Gotta celebrate. Kinda creepy. You're sweet, Lee. <laughs> nah. Oh, not this bit. What? No, uh, nothing. I just... You're trying to remember what you forgot? Well, I, uh... Yeah. Yeah. So tomorrow, you and me in the ring. You ready? Of course. Don't hold back, Lee. Promise? Mm. No! Oh. 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 Huh? Are you okay? Lee! Uh, yeah. Sorry. You're crying. What's wrong? Uh. Something in my eyes. Lee. I'm gonna go. Sorry. Okay, but stop apologizing. Fine. On one condition. What? <laughs> Call me Axel from now on. Got it? Memorized? Yeah. Okay, Axel. I like, I like how the color scheme of his hair is, uh... Like, it's brown roots with red, like, slowly fading out into the thing. That face from the portrait I mentioned? 
It wasn't just some stranger that Handsome the Wise took under his wing. 